Good Monday evening, and thank you for joining us on Hawaii's only live local newscast at 7. Our top story tonight, rolling blackouts continue on Kauai because the power company's largest generator is not working, and several other power units are either down for maintenance or repair. The Kauai Island Utility Cooperative says customers can expect a 30-minute outage every three to four hours. Customers should conserve power. It started yesterday when the company's largest generator, the Kapaya Power Station, failed. We're an indoor cycling studio, and within the first 10 minutes of class, all the power went out. And the way that we, our system is set up is everything is, all of our bikes have power meters and everything is connected to a computer that's displayed on a big screen. And so without power, it really affected our ride, but I was able to just pull up the the sound on my phone, and we were able to continue the class. The only issue was no air conditioning or no fans. The company says the rolling blackouts will continue through at least tomorrow morning, and the weather's not helping that either. No, the cloudy weather put a damper on solar production. Let's go straight to Jess and Cruz now with your most accurate forecast. Jess. Definitely cloudy skies right now. We're seeing thunderstorm activity to the south, and that's what's pushing these high clouds over the islands. It's probably going to be cloudy for at least another day or so when it starts to clear out, no later than Wednesday. But the storm, it looks more um, ominous than it actually is because we're not seeing all that much shower activity uh, from the system. We are seeing some showers reaching Kauai, but most of it is to the south of the state. So no major issues there. This system will slowly move away and to the west of the islands over the course of the next 24 hours. Still, it's a bit hot for parts of the state today. In fact, it hit 93 for Kahului, 90 for Molokai, 88 for Honolulu, a bit cooler for Hilo at 79, and Lihue checks in at 83. So overall, the trade wind weather pattern is going to continue. No end inside to the trade winds. In fact, they'll be up a notch by Wednesday into the breezy levels, just cloudy skies and scattered showers for now. Again, that system moving slowly away, and as it does, we'll get our blue sky back no later than Wednesday. Until then, cloudy with scattered showers and breezy trades to 25. Back to the desk.